Blue green algae has been a big issue for South Floridians, but could it end up in your drinking water? News Channel 5's Wanda Moore looked into this. She joins us now with more on what she found. Wanda. West Palm Beach certainly has a very unique water supply system. It's all surface water. We followed your drinking water from the source straight to your tap. Water is a huge staple in our house. It's all we drink. What exactly comes out of your tap? I think it's vital to know what, in fact, they are drinking. The journey of your drinking water starts here at the Grassy Waters Preserve. It's not a challenge to, to treat that water because it's already in a pristine condition. West Palm Beach uses surface water as supply. That means this part of the Everglades, with its unique ecosystem, is closely maintained and protected. This, this is beautiful to us, is a sign the system is working. This is a beautiful sign here that you've got good, clean water, so. These paraphyton are a natural filtration system producing clear water. We check um, and West Palm officials uh, frequently and almost every day. Watch for any change in quality, including possible blue-green algae. We were seeing some uh, levels that it seemed like that there could be some kind of algal bloom going upstream in the L8 area. The water gets analyzed and if the samples are not up to standards. And we decided we didn't want to take a chance and we shut control two down. They know where the impurity occurred and can simply turn off intake from that area. But even the crystal clear water is still not ready for you. And this is where the water gets treated before it gets sent out to close to 100,000 people. The final step is the water treatment plant. Here you go, bud. To make sure okay. the citizens depend on us to provide them uh, safe, clean drinking water. Your water is safe to drink. And there are certainly many, many steps your water has to go through before it arrives in your kitchen. You can see a map right now where the water really comes from. So it starts at Lake Okeechobee and then hits that first control structure. Again, if any impurities are found in their tests, they can shut off intake at that time. And then it continues to that grassy waters preserve area where we filmed most of our story. Certainly beautiful area out there. And then it gets treated here at the water treatment plant before you finally can drink it at home. We're live in West Palm Beach. Wanda Moore, WPTV, News Channel 5.